everyone welcome back to another video so today I am going to be doing the ruler of books book tag and hence why I have a crown because if I'm gonna be the queen of my own book kingdom I need a crown so um, this tag was created by Ariel over at Ariel Bissette I will leave a link to her video down in the description below so basically this tag is if you were to have your own book kingdom what would be the rules or requirements to live in that book kingdom so question number one is what book would you make everyone read and so for this question and for most of the questions i have uh, actually two books to show you guys and that is The Realm of Glass by Sarah J Mass. I love 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 this book I don't know how many times I have to say it but I absolutely love it and if you were to live in my kingdom you must read this series because it is amazing the second one another all-time favorite series and that by one of my favorite authors so of course if you were to live in my kingdom you would have to read the infernal devices by cassandra claire this is the first book clockwork angel and yes i absolutely love this series one of my all-time all-time top favorite books so, if you live in my kingdom, you better read those books. The next question is, what would you abolish in book construction? So, there's actually a couple things that I would abolish in, in uh, book construction in my kingdom. And the first thing being paperback covers that are like cut off like this. It's becoming a trend, and I don't know why, because it just annoys me. I remember when I first saw a book like this, where the cover was cut off from the rest of the book. I was just like, why? Why? It's one inch you're leaving. What is the purpose of this? I don't know, but it annoys me. The other thing I would abolish would be covers that don't match, okay? You guys know I've talked about this in my um, 25 bookish facts about me. I cannot stand when covers don't match, and I have two different covers on my bookshelves. It just annoys me, so... That's another thing that's going to be abolished. Next question is, what author would you commission to write you any book? Okay, so I'm going to have to go with two of my favorite authors. Either Cassandra Clare, because she's awesome, she rocks, and I love all her books. Or Sarah J. Mass. Because, like I said, I am in love with Throne of Glass. I love, love, love the series. So, Cassandra Clare or Sarah J. Mass, I need them to write me a book for my kingdom. Next question is, what book would you demote to the library basement? One of them is Vampire Diaries by L.J. Smith. I really did not like the book at all. I love the TV show. Absolutely love the TV show. So sad that it's ending and this is the final season because I love the show, but I could not stand the book. Uh, this is one of those rare cases where the show is definitely better than the book. Um, I just, I couldn't stand the characters in in the book, especially Elena, she was so different from the book to the show. 
I like her in the show. In the book, she no. So, yeah. Definitely demoting that series to the basement. And then another book I would demote to the library basement is If I Stay by Gail Foreman. I just really didn't like this book. It, it was just boring and I skimmed through most of it. So yeah, next question is what cover artist would you want to make a mural for your book kingdom? The artist who did the incarnate covers because these covers are just so beautiful. I love the colors. They're gorgeous. And let's see who did this. Gustavo Marx. So yeah, Gustavo Marx. He's got to do a mural for me because I love the covers and the colors on here. Super pretty. So the other um, artist that would have to make a mural for me would be the cover artist who designed Teardrop by Lauren Kate. This cover of Teardrop because they did change the covers. Um, after the first book, the second book has a different cover. I don't know who did those covers. I don't care to know because I hate the new covers. And it annoys me so much that they changed it. Okay, rant over. Anyway, um, cover artist who did this one because it is beautiful. Again, I love the colors. I love the swirly thing through the title. The water, the way like her dress looks like water, you know, evaporating. It's just so gorgeous, so pretty. And who did this one? Let's see. Colin Anderson. So Colin Anderson and Gustavo Marx. They've got to do the mural for my kingdom because I love their artwork. And then the next question is... What, uh, what character's face would you put on a coin? Tessa and Will from Clockwork, uh, from the Infernal Devices, Clockwork Angel being the first. Um, yeah, so Tessa and Will, if anything, I would want them, if I couldn't run my book kingdom, I would want Tessa and Will to rule over my kingdom so their face can be on the coin because yeah who better to rule the kingdom than them they both love books so yeah tess and will next question is what book uh what book would you award the ruler of books 2016 award. Again for this, I've got two books. Um, the first one I'm going to show you is a book that I read in 2016, but wasn't published in 2016. Can you guys guess what I'm about to show you? You probably can, because I talk about it so much because I love it. So, The Round of Glass by Sarah J. Mass. So, like I said, I love this book, and I cannot talk about it quite enough. So, if any book is going to win the Ruler of Books Award for 2016, it is going to be The Realm of Class, even though it wasn't published this year. I read it this year, and I loved it. As far as a book that was actually published this year in 2016. I don't actually have the book to show you guys because I got it from the library and read it so it's already returned. But that is Star Touched Queen by uh, who was Rish Rishani Ch Chalksky? Chalksky? Okay. 
I never know how to say authors' names. I'm probably butchering that. But, yes, The Star Touch Queen. So that was published in, this year in 2016. And I love that book as well. The writing was just so gorgeous, so beautiful. Anyway, that is it for this tag video. Um, if you guys want to do this video, then I tag you. So, yeah. If you do do this video, leave a link to your video down in the comments below. I would love to check them out and see what are some of your rules or requirements for being the ruler of your own book kingdom. And yeah, that's it for this video. I will see you guys next time with another one. Bye.